welcome back to my channel and welcome back to the she shed if you are new here hello i'm talia i do a bunch of fluid painting and i try a bunch of new techniques like today i'm going to be trying a floating flip, flip. i'm going to be trying a floating flip cup say that three times fast <laughs> Just like every technique I try, I try to put my own little spin on it and make it my own and hope that it's not a total fail in the end. If you are excited to see how this one is going to turn up, turn up. If you are excited to see how this one is going to turn out, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Let's get started. Alright, the first color right here is from Deco Art Ultra Blue Deep. The second one is Bright Copper by Deco Art. The black here is a, a hybrid mixture of about three different paints. We have Black by Craftsmart, um, Lamp Ebony, blah, blah, blah. Lamp Ebony Black by Deco Art, and Deep Midnight Blue by Deco Art as well. This one here, Neon Blue by Artist Loft. And here we have a Metallic Blue, Ice Blue by Deco Art. This technique can be done multiple ways. Some people cut off the bottom of their cup and pour the paint directly in and then move it. Other people fill up the cup. Other people will fill up the cup like a regular dirty pour, flip it, take something sharp and poke a hole through the top and let it do its own thing. Alright, the first step is to flood the canvas with black. I'm going to start filling my flip cup up. Now it's the time to do a prayer. I'm just gonna go for it. You gotta kinda pep talk yourself up at this point. All right, one, two, three. Come on, come on. Oh, crushing the cup. Crushing the cup. Are we making a hole? <gasps> we made a hole. I don't think I made the hole big enough. There we go. If I didn't mention before, all my paints are mixed with Floetrol only, so there is no silicone in any of my paints.
I know I wanted to keep negative space in two corners. That's why I started the flip cup in that corner and dragged down. The cup kind of took off a little fast on me. But now I know I need to be ready for it. I'm loving these colors together. It's still spreading out as I speak, but I still really love these cells right here. I wanted to reiterate that I do not have any silicone in any of my paints. It is just acrylic paint and float draw. I'm going to wrap this one up and get this one inside to dry before any bugs decide to land in it. When this piece is dried and varnished, it will be up for sale on my Instagram. Stay tuned there to see how this dries because the copper in it is going to look so cool. I'm super excited. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Your support means so much to me. Happy painting!